how to decide what to choose between computer science and maths how to choose between many children, children are and... many children are really unsure about they seem to enjoy both yes um, that's a, a an interesting question and my suggestion is that you think not about what you liked to do when you were in high school but what you would like to do in the next 40 years so what career do you want what careers are open to people who have a degree in mathematics what careers are open to the degree people with a degree in computer science which ones of these careers would you actually sign up for would you be happy if they offered you one of these places and then optimize for that in your choice of uh, undergraduate degree don't choose the undergrad degree on the basis oh i really like this thing i'd like to study this textbook if that's not what you want to do for the rest of your life i mean clearly the stuff that you do in the undergraduate is not going to be the same as what you do the rest of your life if nothing else because in this type of field the stuff you're going to be doing when you're 30 and 40 hasn't been invented yet so we cannot teach you we can teach you the basics that will help you navigate anything else that gets invented anything else that you invent i mean when i when it was an undergraduate, the World Wide Web had not been invented. Now, <laughs> imagine how much of my course depends on the existence of the World Wide Web and security implications of that and so on. So uh, it is not the case that what you do at university will be teaching you everything you need to know for the rest of your professional career. It is the case that if you do a good course in a good university like here, then you will be prepared to learn everything else that you need to learn. The most important thing you will learn if you do well in your undergrad degree is how to learn new things, which didn't exist at the time you took that degree.